I show the top 10 war bases to win a lot of wars, but every single base is with a link in the description. This base, I like it a lot because of the Inferno Towers, they are so well protected, so it is not easy for the Lava Loon or a Queen Walk to get the Inferno Towers. I like this base a lot because of the Inferno Towers and the Expo. They are so well protected around the tunnel, so it is pretty complex to get a 2 star because you need the tunnel to get the 2 star. The clan castle in the middle is hard to lure and the Expo together in this base is really well in my opinion. Why I like this base a lot because the shape of the walls makes it difficult to funnel towards the center. Heroes in the middle and the CC is difficult to lure. This base is in my opinion very difficult because it has many compartments in the base and the clan castle is difficult to lure because he's in the center and that makes it hard to lure the clan castle. Don't forget to use the CC troops what I recommend because that's the best of the best. This base is in my opinion really good again because of inferno towers. The inferno towers are so well protected again and there is a multi and a single inferno so that's really good and the tunnels in the center too. That makes it cool and explosives are so well protected. This is a really good base because the good defenses are so good protected. This base is in my opinion really good against spam attacks because you can just go to the town and all defenses around are still alive. But it's only good against spam attacks. I think so. This base is in my opinion one of the best anti free star bases because I have no idea how to attack with a queen walk or just a spam attack. I don't know this base is so good I don't know how to funnel with a lock launcher or something like that. I have really no idea. This base is the combination that puts everything together in the middle with the clan castle that can do some pretty damage to your queen. And that's why I like this base a lot. Base number 1, yes this is an anti 2 star base because of the town walls in the center plus the inferno towers are so well protected. Look at this. You think there is a wall, isn't it? No there isn't because there is for the queen funneling really bad because your queen can go super fast down. Look at this. When your queen is going to the expo and the archie tower, the inferno tower can just hit so fast the queen that the queen is going down so quickly. That's why this base is so good. And against a spam attack, I don't know how to get the town. The town was so good protected. That's why I like this base as number one as anti two star. But the best base in my opinion because the town is so good in the center. But I hope you liked it and subscribe.